What's up, guys? Zergriz here, playing a little TDM on Radiation. Um, I know I haven't been posting up a lot of gameplays here lately because I've been focusing more on these tutorials. Um, like I said before, I got a late start on Modern Warfare 2, getting the tutorials out. So I wanted to get an early jump on Black Ops to make sure I got all the maps, you know, all the tutorials for all the maps done. Um, I will be doing tutorials for the new maps coming out February 1st, the First Strike uh, DLC. So be looking forward to those. I'll probably jump in as soon as those maps come out and bust out like you know two maps, and then I'll just throw the like the other two or three or whatever back into the mix uh, as time goes on. But I know I've had like a lot of people like the um, the tutorials that I'm doing, and uh, I've been getting a lot of positive feedback and some good comments on those. And speaking of comments, I did have a comment on one of the tutorials. And they were asking, basically, you know, like, what my opinion is as far as people joining my session, uh, sniper lobbies, and, and things of that nature. So I said, you know, I'd, I would take a commentary and kind of touch on that. So that's basically what I'm doing. I figured this was probably a pretty good game. This is a really close to a full sniper lobby. I think that there's maybe one or two people from each team that are using fully autos. But other than that, you know, for the most part, everybody's sniping. So uh, I'm rocking the... Uh, variable scope on my L96, and that is probably one of my favorite attachments. Um, I'm, I dig the infrared. I'm actually getting pretty good with the infrared. The ACOG's not too hard to use. Um, reg scope's actually pretty good. I can pretty much use them all, but uh, I prefer to use the variable. And sometimes I'll rock Warlord Pro, you know, for the two Tomahawks, and I'll throw on extended mags along with my variable and uh, rock it out that way. But as far as like people join in my session um, that was done a lot back in Call of Duty 4 uh, like when I was doing my matrix montage and a lot of people didn't like that you know they didn't like uh, like montage clips with uh, snipers and stuff like that so I tried to kinda stay away from that when Modern Warfare 2 came out and I always you know appear offline or I have my my preferences set to appear offline it's a nice little tomahawk right there but um, that way people can't join, and then I don't have, you know, a huge sniper lobby for every clip. Now, don't get me wrong, I like having snipers in the room because, you know, I always love playing against other really good snipers because in this game, because sniping's so difficult, it's really far and few between that you find somebody that's actually really good with a sniper rifle that can run and gun and keep up with the crowd, you know, whether they're using snipers or fully autos. But, uh, yeah, so... I try to avoid that not so much because I don't like playing with fans or anything like that, but it's